I'm Shelly Turner with the Builder All team. In this video, I'm going to show you how to grab your coupon and put it into your Amazon coupon funnel. So the first thing I'm going to do is take you to the Retail Me Not page and I'm going to show you exactly how I get the coupon. So here I am on the Retail Me Not page. I've looked up Amazon promo codes and I'm just going to scroll down and I have actually found a product that I'm ready to promote and I'm ready to get the coupon to be able to promote it. So as I'm scrolling down, I run into this item right here. It's 40% off wireless Bluetooth sports stereo universal headphones. And here's the coupon right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open a notepad and I'm going to go to the Amazon site and I'm going to not only copy the coupon, but I'm going to copy information about this product. So once I clicked on the coupon, it copied the coupon for me and then it took me directly to Amazon. So from here, I'm going to go ahead and copy the description of the item. I'm going to copy the features of the item. And then I'm going to go through and download each one of these pictures. And then I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to copy the customer questions and the answers. And then I'm going to go down and find some good reviews. And I'm going to copy all of that information into my notepad. So here I have my notepad open. And I've got the description, the coupon code, all of the features. I have the questions that are inside the Amazon page. And I picked a couple of reviews and copied them into my notepad. All of these things I can use in my Amazon coupon funnel. Also remember that I copied all of the pictures and saved them onto my computer so that if I need pictures for the funnel, I actually have pictures available too. So now I can get started on first putting my coupon into the funnel. So here I am on my dashboard and I'm gonna go ahead and open the template for the Amazon coupon funnel. So I'm gonna to go to Builders and then drag and drop Pixel Perfect and new website. Once that opens, I'm gonna find the sales funnels and click the arrow. And then I'm gonna to go to Amazon coupon funnel and click that. And that opens the only template I have for the coupon funnel and I'm gonna click edit. Now my coupon funnel is open and the very first thing I need to do is go up to the top right hand side and click save. And then I'm gonna give it a name and then I'm gonna click send, save. And what that does is that adds it to my site list in the Pixel Perfect site list in your dashboard. So now if you have to leave this project, you can go back to the project later and it will be there. You won't have to start from scratch. So now that I've got it saved to my site list, I'm gonna to go to the double gears and I'm gonna to go to coupon configuration. Now this is where I'm gonna put my coupons at and I'm gonna go ahead and create a new list of coupons. So I'm gonna click that button and I can title this. So I'm gonna title this Amazon earphones. And now I put my list of coupons. Now, if you remember, the list of coupons was only one coupon, but I'm gonna go ahead and offer this to 100 people. So what I effectively need to do is put that coupon in there 100 times. So I'm gonna go ahead and access my coupon on my notepad. So here's my coupon code right here. I'm gonna highlight it and copy it. Then I'm gonna go back to where I can put my coupons in. And in the list of coupons area, I'm gonna paste that. I'm gonna paste it five times. Each time I'm gonna press enter. So one, two, three, four, five. And now what I'm gonna to do to make my life easier is to copy those five. And from there, I'm gonna just paste. So I have five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Now it's been copied 50 times. I'm just gonna highlight all of it and copy and go down to the end and paste one more time. And now I've pasted it 100 times and each time I've put enter after each one so that each one is seen as an individual coupon even though they're all the same. So once I've done that, I just click save and now I can see that I have all my coupons in there all the way up to 100 and I click save again. And it says, do you really want to add this list of coupons, I'll click confirm. And then it says coupon list added with success and close. So now I have my list of coupons and it's under the Amazon earphones list. Don't forget to click save in the top right hand corner and then save again. And that will make sure that all the changes that you've made so far 
are saved onto your website. And now we're ready to move on to the next video.